Hi, this is Lance from HealthySimulation.com. We're at IMSH 2014. I'm standing next to Peter. He's one of the co-founders and uh, uh, leaders, president. Is that your title? Yeah, CEO. CEO, that's a good title to have, uh, of uh, iSimulate. And I know that there's a, a new upgrade to ALSI, which uh, Healthy Simulation did a really uh, thorough rundown of last year. But I know we've got a new update here, so I'm really we excited did. to hear about where the product has gone since then. So, uh, as you know, the product uh, took a fairly significant movement last year in making it more realistic. Again, this year, the feedback from our users has asked for some more stuff. Okay. So, of course, we put stuff in. Yeah. Uh, so, the principles are the same. Everything's touch screen, instructor-led. Uh, you know, in this case, I'm a simulator patient, got leads on, a SATS probe, and we still, still touch things to make things happen. Right. Uh, but what we've done is we've made the scenarios run in line. Okay. So you can now mark the comments, but you can also press and hold to allow those comments to be added to, like did not do or... Okay, so yeah. that's kind of a topic hub, and then from there we can go further in depth into what happened with that particular Correct. area. Correct. So that becomes an audit tool then, so you can view the log... Later and see exactly, exactly what you Exactly right. Selected. So those comments are there for later. Right. Uh, we've now introduced uh, timed events as well. So not only like we had before where you could put a trend in. Right. What we've done now, for instance, if we make the rate go really fast, if for in this case we were going to give a drug like adenosine, we can build in a three second change. So we have a three second period of asystole. A delay before that takes yes. place. So each box can now have a time. So you could run an automatic scenario. Right. So not just, a, not just a... Uh, length of time before that fully takes effect, but a delay before the process even correct. begins. Okay, that's correct. All right, um, we've introduced a whole new range of waveforms. Okay, so now you have a number of CO2 waveforms for people that are uh, losing their paralysis or waking up or low breathers or whatever. Mm -hmm. So now CO2, which is very important, right, is now covered really extensively, as well as a new range of ECGs, much easier to find. So the interface has been greatly improved Okay. Uh, from very simple before to even better. Yeah. Uh, so you can change waveforms, you can turn waveforms on, you know, we can still shock, but we've improved the interface as well. So now it's a lot easier to look at, you know, press the buttons, get the charge effect, all that still happens, but it's just a bit neater, a bit nicer. Sure. We can also now... Um, bring in a whole range of things like uh, if you've done a CBC what we can do now though is send it to the screen for the student to look at. Okay great so we can start to send some of the data and the facts about the patient what's happening right to the screen so that information becomes available immediately. Correct and we're gonna, you can do the same thing with x-rays, scans and so forth. Genius. That's about a week away. Okay. Uh, but you know to show you for instance you've got a 12 lead you can bring it straight forward, so, chest x-rays. Great. Uh, and also videos such as a Oh wow, echo. perfect. Okay, so whatever whatever additional data we can program that into the scenario build and use it later in there. And use all your own stuff. Right. Now you can now, now also import, and we'll just kill the sound a bit. You can now import all your own sounds. Okay. So you can have an American, you can have Spanish, you can okay. have German. So we can use this device as well. We can use ALSI uh, to be the sounds of what's happening in the serum. Uh, beyond our own voice, but anything that we want to add in terms Correct. of that. Wow, fantastic. So you can have male, female, but then you can have folders of different languages. Wow. So therefore, you can customize your training to your group. Yeah. Well, Peter, this definitely looks like we've uh, taken ALSI and continue to improve and build upon it, evolve it to become the, uh, the, the, the affordable way of providing patient monitors and that higher fidelity experience for those low fidelity mannequins or standardized patients and really be able to take everything to that next level. So yep. um, so this is always, uh, this is available now, this is kind of an upgraded yes, model. Is. And is it still in a, a license base or how, how, how are folks getting access yeah. to it? Most of the people buy uh, membership to our system okay. and that's a one-off purchase price. Okay. So at the worst, it's uh, $7,300. Okay. We also have a subscription scheme for people that would like to buy at a lower rate and pay it every year. Okay, great. And that's two thousand in year one for the license, and then a thousand every year, year after that. Okay. However, if they upgrade in the first year, 
they can upgrade for the difference in price with no extra add-ons. Right. So it gives them two years to, to, to evaluate, essentially buy. Right, and then to make that purchase decision. Correct. And so what's fantastic about that is uh, if you were to buy it, uh, into it, then for the life of this software, you're getting all those uh, th those upgrades for free. On so either system. Everything that just continues yeah. to go. So whether you buy it up front or you buy the subscription, yeah. you still get all your upgrades. This is version three everybody that's continued to get upgrades as we go. Yeah. Well, uh, Peter, I know we're really excited about uh, iSimulate support of SimGhost uh, 2014 yes. in Australia. So are we. University of the Sunshine Coast, uh, June 25th through the 27th. So we're really excited to see you guys there. And we know that there's a lot of support for uh, uh, your company in Australia. Hundreds of users are, yeah. are, are utilizing ALSI and other products from you guys. So we're Absolutely. really excited about connecting so, with that group. And don't forget that we also have our obstetric model as well. So. Fantastic. You can get on and get free trials of all this stuff. Okay. They have a good play. And where, where, where do people get, uh, what's the so website So they go again? to iSimulate.com. iSimulate.com. They can follow on, they can download a free trial, 30 days, play, see if it works for you. Yeah. And if it does, contact Great. us. Let's, no let's pressure. do something, absolutely. Well, I definitely want to uh, remind folks, I'm going to put the link here in the video and also on the, on the post, that they can watch uh, my full comprehensive uh, demonstration of ALSI from 2013 when I sat down. Uh, here in the states and learn more about the software, so we can you can get more in depth there and really kind of see what's going on. Uh, and then, of course, you can visit the website to learn more. Absolutely. Hey, thanks, Peter. Really appreciate it. All right. See you in uh, June. Absolutely. <laughs>